Hey everyone, in this video we are going to see how to add mailbox permission in Office 365. So this is my Office 365 portal. Here we need to go to Exchange Admin Center. Click on Admin Center, click on Exchange. It will open my Exchange Admin Center. Go to Recipient. Now first, first we will check for Shared Mailbox permission. Let's say I want to grant Shared, mail, shared Mailbox permission to a user account. So on this shared mailbox, I will give access to other user mailboxes. Double click on this mailbox. Under mailbox delegation tab, you can grant full access and send us permission to a user to a user account or mailbox on this shared mailbox. Click on add. Select the mailbox that you want to give access. Click on add. Okay. Now let's say I want to add send us permission also. Now with this with this full access permission, this user can access the emails and all the Outlook items that present in this shared mailbox. And with this send us permission, this user account test account can send email from this shared mailbox. So this is the use of full access and send us permission with having only full access permission the user cannot send email from the shared mailbox it need to have send us permission click on save now we will see how to add mailbox permission through powershell so this is my microsoft exchange online powershell we will run command to add mailbox permission through powershell so Type command add mailbox add mailbox permission identity. Here we need to give identity of shared mailbox. We will copy this shared mailbox email address, paste it, and user. Let's say I want to give full access permission to this user account. I will copy the email address of this user mailbox test it I need to specify access right let's say this this is full access enter now this user account have full access permission on this shared mailbox now we will check how to add permission send us permission so we need to have add recipient permission identity the shared mailbox name Then here we need to type trusty for send us permission. Not a not a user. Then access right as send as enter. Now this is now this is asking for confirmation. Click select Y and enter. Now this user account have send us permission on this shared mailbox. Now we will verify in GUI. So we have granted this user account full access and sender's permission on this shared mailbox. Now we will check. So this user account now have full access and sender's permission on this shared mailbox. So this way we can grant full access and sender's permission on this shared mailbox. Same we will apply for user mailbox. So we need to have same tab like mailbox delegation. Here we can grant send as and send on behalf or full access permission to a different account. Depends upon our requirement. And finally, thanks for watching.